G'day viewers, welcome to the third episode of Shano and Wayno's World. What are we going to get up to, Wayno? Well, Shano, I thought we'd um, start off with a holiday we took at Christmas with the family up to Rainbow Beach. Yep. Yep. We, yep. Um, we went to Inskip, Fraser Island, and a bit along Rain Rainbow Beach and Double Island Point. Yeah. So we might just break it up in a couple of episodes, this one. Yeah, we'll probably just do Fraser Island and uh, Inskip on this one. Yep, sounds good. Um, we'll put in a product review on a fantastic mosquito repellent device we found. Yep. Uh, and we thought we'd kick off this episode with a tour of the Shano and Wayno headquarters, which is a man cave in my shed. Yep. So um, sit back and Enjoy. Have, a, have a good look. Hey viewers, welcome to the Shano and Wayno headquarters. This is a man cave I knocked up in my shed a few years ago. Uh, it's all lined with old pallet wood that um, I brought home from work. Uh, insulated, it lined the whole thing, the floor, everything's all pallet wood. Um, whacked in a pot belly stove just recently. Uh, I'll show you a before picture of that as well, that it had it. Uh, a couple of nice leather chairs. Old jukebox in the corner, telly for the footy, and a dartboard, and um, yeah, this is where plenty of uh, drinking sessions happen. Right, I know we started our trip at the Big Four Caravan Park at Rainbow Beach. Why did uh, why did we pick that one, mate? Mate, we picked that one because it's away from the hustle and bustle of town. It's close to the boat ramp, and it feels like a bush feeling out there. You can camp under the trees. Yeah, it was good. We took the tinny, so we were able to whack that in, and um, we took the crab pots and got a few nice muddies. Yep, there's also a um, jetty there you can throw a line off. Yeah. Or... A, a, and if you're lucky, a local dolphin comes in every arvo and uh, for a visit. Yep. And there's a there was a restaurant on the jetty too. Yeah, right? like a little takeaway. Yeah. So fish and chips or something. Yeah. Don't they? No, it's great. You're still only a few minutes out of town, but um, doesn't feel like you're stuck in the middle of town. So it's it's a good spot. Yep. Inskip Point is now for its southern gateway to the Fraser Island. It's only a short 10 minute journey by barge across the Fraser Island. Yep, yeah, uh, for a single car or four wheel drive, it's about $120 return, but prices do go up um, if you're taking a trailer and things like that. Uh, it's also, Inskip's a nice spot to um, just spend the day. It's beautiful. We, we put up the barbie and we took the canoes yeah, over, didn't we? Yeah, we actually kayaked yeah. over to Fraser. It almost killed us. But, I know. <laughs> but yeah, no, it's a good spot. Just arrived on Fraser Island now. Did you know Fraser Island is the largest sand island in the world? It's 123 kilometres long and 22 k's wide. Yeah, there's plenty of places to camp um, and plenty of freshwater lakes. Lake Mackenzie's spectacular. Um, and there's a freshwater creek, Eli Creek is amazing. But just give yourself plenty of time because to travel 20 k's takes you about two hours inland. On the beach, it's fine, but inland it takes a long time to get places. So you want to give yourself a full day. There's also a couple of shipwrecks to see too, mate. Yeah, shipwrecks. Be careful because planes land on the bloody beach right next to you. So, great spot. Oh, it freaks you out, doesn't it? Yeah, I know. <laughs> right, hey viewers. When we were up the Fraser Coast, we were getting smashed by mozzies. So lucky we took away a couple of these. A thermo cell. Do you want to run through them there, Shana? Yeah, sure. Uh, you pick one of them up for around 40 bucks. Uh, they uh, you get the refills. The refill, this is only a 12 hour one, but you can get a 48 hour one, which is like, uh, I think about 40 bucks. Yeah, yeah, just under 40. So, um, 
what you do is you've got a little gas cylinder cartridge you whack that in take the lid off put that in you screw it in until you hear it break the seal yep. which is that Righto. <coughs> you also have a little tab you put in the top there too. Yeah, there. I've got one in there at the moment, but you get um, little tabs that slide in there. They last for about four hours. So when you've got all that done, you just flick it on. Got a little ignition thing. I think you've got a in that's the top it, there. It. There's a little flame. She's going there. I can hear her. Yeah, yeah she's yeah. going now. So that'll put off an odorless smell, and um, we had two of them. Uh, they cover what do they cover? 21, 20, 21, 21 square, square meters. Square meters. Beach, yeah. So we had two. We had one at either end of the our quick shades, and no, they, they worked. We didn't get dream, didn't they? Yeah, they were awesome. Absolutely fantastic they, product. They took about ten minutes to work there to take it. Yeah, effect, 10, 15 minutes. Yeah. Um, they put off a little bit of smoke, like a, but you can't smell it or anything, no. and it. Bit of them, those uh, smelly and, uh, round things. Work great, didn't stop the midges, but yep. it's uh, definitely stops the mosquitoes. Yep. So we definitely recommend giving that a go. G'day viewers, thanks for watching the third episode of the Wayne and Shane Show. What do you reckon, Shane? Yeah, it wasn't a bad one, I had a bit of fun making it. Yeah. Um, next week we'll show you the rest of our trip on the Fraser Coast, the Rainbow Beach, and a bit of fall driving. Yeah. We might even put in a bit of um, camp oven cooking. Yeah, might do one of your do one of your famous stews if you get down the night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that sounds good. Mate. So I've done some views doing that. Yeah, yeah. It's a good night though. Yeah. Yeah. But anyway, um, so yeah, don't forget to subscribe. Yep, and you can still follow us on Facebook. Yep, and leave comments. Tell yes. us what you think. Yeah, any anything you want to ask, just go ahead and ask us. Yeah. I'm happy to answer it. We, we might know. We'll give it a go. That's it. All right, I'll see you next week. G'day viewers, as promised, down at the Blue Lake now. Uh, oh my really god, it's Wayne! It's Wayne! Oh my god, Mom! We love you, Wayne! Thanks, girls! <laughs> Hi! How are you today? This is Wayne. Shane's in having a slash. Here he comes now. <laughs>